Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the show. This is our take. We are your hosts. I'm Ocean. I'm Taylor. And ladies and gentlemen, we've got a trailer reaction for you today. This one is to something I had no idea was even happening. Um, I'm pretty, pretty excited about it for me, personally. Uh, but ladies and gentlemen, uh, we are going to be giving you guys our take on the trailer that was just released a few days ago for an Apple TV original. Uh, this is Monarch Legacy of Monsters. If you have no idea what that is or any idea what it means, because uh, the name in it itself doesn't really give a whole lot of hints, this is a, what seems like to be the story of Monarch, the company or the organization that is in the Godzilla and Kong movies. Um, yeah. So, uh, what is the what is the company in Jurassic Park? Which one? The like company that runs the frick. Well, there there's multiple. Actually. Groups involved with Jurassic Park slash Jurassic World, but I'm assuming you're talking about InGen. Yes, InGen. Sorry. Uh, anyway, um, so yeah, so this is this seems to be a spinoff TV show that uh, is going to happen and going to tell the story of kind of how that company that dealt with these monsters back in the day started and how they influence things in the world of the monsters that we've seen through Godzilla as well as Kong, Kong and Skull Island and uh, Godzilla versus Kong. Because now we have Godzilla X Kong coming out yep. next year, maybe? Sometime. I don't right? remember. I don't remember I think, either. Yeah. Um, yeah, coming out sometime in the somewhat near future. Uh, but yeah, it looks interesting. I don't know. What do you think? I mean, it looks cool. Uh, I I love the MonsterVerse and Godzilla and Kong and all everything that's involved in that. Um, I loved all the movies, including the bad ones. <laughs> uh, I can never get enough monster movies. Yeah? But I have a big problem with them that they always repeat every single time, and that's people. I don't fucking care about people <laughs> in monster movies. I just want the fucking monsters, all right? Now, this is seemingly kind of an origin story of Monarch. Um, I don't know if I read, like, if that's the focus, I think it's going to be kind of mixed, but Godzilla still looks cool, yeah. and he still sounds good, and the production quality looks like it matches. It looks solid. It looks um, like there's I mean, some it looks new monsters. Really good seen. for Apple, yeah. like because they don't, you know, they don't make a whole lot. So it seems like they pumped a lot of money into this to get this. And they also the cast list is pretty impressive too. Yeah, there's some good actors from the trailer and stuff, so that's exciting. I'll be honest, I had no idea that Wyatt Russell and Kurt Russell were father and son. It's know. just another. Uh, <laughs> I just didn't know. Uh, I didn't know I that know Wyatt that Russell's is. name was Wyatt Russell. I know him, like I know his face. I've seen him in a bunch of movies and stuff, so I know who he is. But I just never knew his name, so I didn't know they were father and son. So the first time I watched this trailer, I was like, "Wow, they did a really good job casting." Because <laughs> uh, Wyatt Russell plays. I'm, I'm guessing based off of the trailer, he's going to play the uh, version of Kurt Russell's character in the past. And and there's gonna kind of be these flashback, flashing back and forth kind of storytelling. And so when I saw it, I was like, damn, they nailed the casting on uh getting a a younger version of Kurt Russell. Uh turns it out is. It, it basically <laughs> is. It's just his son. So yeah. uh that was I thought that was pretty funny when I looked up the cast list. I was like, Oh, that makes sense. <laughs> yeah. Stupid me. Uh but John Goodman is in it as well. He's great. Uh, I, I don't know what to what capacity, but he, I mean, it's always good to see him. Yeah, I'm always always down to see him. So, yeah, I think this one could be interesting, man. Uh, I I also agree. That I'm I'm for monster movies. Uh, I 
don't know if I particularly care about whether or not there's humans in it. Sometimes it works. Sometimes it doesn't. Well, I don't care that there, if there's humans in it. You just don't want the it to be the focus, they, right? They always focus on the humans. Yeah, and their Nobody story. cares about the humans. When you have it in like a... Uh, yeah, like Kong versus Godzilla. We didn't care about the little girl that was able to talk to Kong and like control him. All we wanted to see was Godzilla and Kong just duke it out. That's all we wanted. Like as far as Kong goes... Um, the people that literally dedicate themselves to like serving him and stuff, or taking helping care of him, him, yeah, and uh, he also takes care of them, and they live on the island, yeah, perfect. Uh, and Godzilla, you had all the fucking, you had um, I can't remember his name. Uh, he's 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 gonna be the new Craven, and he's also in Kick Ass. Uh, that guy, he was like a special forces dude, and his dad was oh. um. The guy from Breaking Bad, they were great because they're just like side things that like kind of um, are working around the monsters. But yeah. like, if you ever try to get me to like care about fucking people and you constantly show me people, I I don't want it. Like, yeah, we just want to see fight or monsters fight. You're talking about Aaron Taylor Johnson. Yes. You know? Yeah. Yeah, Aaron Taylor Johnson. Yeah, we just want to see monsters fight, y'all. Just duke it out. Just just beat beating each other up. They, That's what like made, they already have plenty of lore themselves, like the yeah. monsters and everything. That's what made don't King Kong stuff. the one with um what's her face? The one where he like beats it or he's on the top of Eiffel Tower and he hits the plane and then he rips the dinosaur's mouth open. Oh, Peter Jackson's King Kong? Yeah, Peter Jackson. That's what made that one so sick. Cause there's just monsters fighting the whole time. It was awesome. Right, like Kong is the, like, I mean, they kind of did lean a little heavy into the fucking girl being yeah. like a beauty, whatever. Sure. But Kong was awesome. Oh, Nicole right? Kidman. All the monsters were awesome, yeah. Nicole Kidman. Um, fucking Jack Black was awesome. Yeah. There's so many. Uh, Andy Serkis was awesome dude, in oh, it. Oh, I forgot Andy was in that movie. He was the fucking, movie. the badass chef oh dude who dies. But he, he's like the yeah. it's like a French chef or something, and he's. I'm gonna like, have to rewatch that shitty. movie. It's a great movie because that that was one of my favorite like my yeah. favorite scenes in that movie is when he's fighting the T Rexes and then he just like grabs her mouth and he's just like, yeah, and I just really in good my movie. head as a kid I was like that is the coolest fucking thing I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> but that movie, just like some of the other ones, doesn't like heavily lean on right. the in the beginning. It kind of does, but it's just setting up the. You know, the to mysteriousness there, yeah. of everything. The island and stuff. But yeah. after that, like, it's all about Kong, and that's it. Yeah, I like it. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, I think this one probably is going to be a little more per- person-focused because it's focused on the company, Monarch. But yeah, uh, hopefully there's a sucks, healthy but... – Just hopefully there's just a healthy dose of monsters okay. and fighting, and, that, and that'll help. Uh, and then hopefully that sets us up for Kong versus – or Kong and Godzilla – to see what that's like. So, yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen, what did you guys think about that trailer? Have you seen it yet? Did you even know what was happening? Because I didn't. Uh, but it's coming out pretty soon, November 17th, I believe. Uh, keep an eye on it. Uh, I don't know. I don't have Apple TV Plus right now, so I don't know. We're going to have to, if we want to watch it, we're going to have to figure something out. Yeah. Uh, if you guys want to share your subscription, let us know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know if I help us out. That, but. Uh, but thank you guys for being here. As always, uh, we really appreciate you guys. Thank you guys for all the love and support, watching all the videos as we continue. We do this because you guys watch them. Uh, so as long as you guys watch these videos, we'll continue to do it. We'll continue to pump it out and uh, give you guys more content. Uh, as I said a couple weeks ago, we are working on a new um, – series or so something to, something new for the channel so make sure you guys stay tuned for that should be a pretty fun uh change up for for the channel um uh, and if as always if there's anything that you guys want to see any um any suggestions or things you guys want to see us review we did get one recently that uh we'll, we'll probably do a video on uh so please send them in so that we we can show you guys exactly what you want to see yep uh Thank you, guys. Appreciate you. Please like, subscribe, comment, share with a friend. Check out our social media as well as the other shows here on the channel. And we appreciate you guys. Catch you guys in the next episode. Bye, guys.